In this demo, researchers at the Institute for the Wireless Internet of Things at Northeastern University will demonstrate how ORAN XAPS using deep reinforcement learning can be utilized to optimize radio resource management in a fully programmable and virtualized radio access network. Researchers at the Institute for Wireless Internet of Things, or WIOT, envision a future where people are wirelessly connected by a continuum of AI-powered devices and networks, from driverless cars and search-and-rescue drone swarms to implantable medical devices and smart cities. The Institute is home to world-leading expertise, facilities, and technologies dedicated to making wireless communications exponentially faster, more energy-efficient, and more secure. Facilities at WIOT include Coliseum, the world's largest wireless network emulator with hardware in the loop. With its 256 software-defined radios, 24 racks of powerful compute servers, and one-of-its-kind channel emulator, Coliseum allows researchers and practitioners to prototype wireless solutions at scale and guarantees reproducibility and replicability of results. Coliseum is currently supported by a National Science Foundation grant. This demo will showcase an instance of an ORAN-compliant network controlled through data-driven algorithms based on deep reinforcement learning optimization. This is performed by ORAN X apps that run on the near real-time RAN Intelligent Controller, or RIC. The demo runs on a fully virtualized and software-defined testbed, which allows us to easily collect large-scale datasets and perform experiments in a wide range of wireless scenarios. We will show how an optimization-based orchestrator automatically deploys X apps based on high-level intent expressed by the network operator, and how these X apps use closed-loop DRL-based control to improve the performance of the RAN in real-time. The RAN instantiated in this demo includes seven base stations, with six mobile users each, for a total of 49 cellular nodes. The emulated scenario mimics a real-world cellular deployment in downtown Rome, Italy, with the positions of the base stations derived from the OpenCelliD database, which gathers data from real-world cellular deployments. While for this demo, we focus on this specific scenario, Coliseum is capable of replicating the same experiment on different radio environments, for example, a mall, a city block, a rural farm. This is key for the development of machine learning and artificial intelligence solutions for networking, as it makes it possible to collect data on heterogeneous wireless scenarios. They can represent different deployment areas for a network operator with different traffic patterns, incumbents, and user mobility. This helps machine learning algorithms to generalize and be ready for deployment on production networks with minimal retraining. Additionally, the emulated environment in Coliseum enables training and testing of closed-loop control with DRL agents without the risk of deteriorating the performance of a production radio access network. Base stations and users run a softwareized protocol stack based on SRS RAN extended to support the E2 interface and data collection capabilities through our SCOPE framework. Users are distributed in three network slices for enhanced mobile broadband traffic, ultra-reliable low-latency applications, and machine-type communications. The goal is to optimize the performance of each slice. The ORAN infrastructure is based on the ORAN software community near real-time RIC, with custom service models for real-time data collection and RAN control over E2. The X app controls the selection of the scheduling policy and the amount of resources for each slice. Additional X apps can be deployed for traffic and buffer forecasting. A proprietary orchestrator selects which X apps need to be deployed according to the operator's intent. We first deploy components of the near real-time RIC as Docker containers on a dedicated Coliseum node. The RIC database, the E2 manager, and the E2 termination container, which interface with the softwareized base stations. We then instantiate a cellular network composed of 49 softwareized nodes on the white box infrastructure of Coliseum, seven base stations, and 42 users. Upon startup, the seven DUs complete the attachment procedures with the E2 termination of the near real-time RIC. At the same time, the DU starts, 
After a few moments, the 42 users of the RAN also start and complete the attachment procedures with the DU. At this point, we start the network orchestrator. This component takes as input service requests submitted by one or multiple telecom operators and optimizes the allocation of resources and the deployment of X apps to satisfy these requests. Examples can be a telecom operator that wants to deploy an X app to optimize the scheduling policies of the DUs located in a certain area. Upon startup, the orchestrator finds the optimal allocations of X apps based on operator requests and instantiates the X apps on the near real time RIC. The X apps subscribe to the DUs indicated by the telecom operator. After this step, the DUs start transmitting performance metrics to the X apps through the E2 interface. Metrics exchanged in this demo include the amount of resources requested and granted to the users and the data rate of the users. These metrics are used at the X apps to perform the tasks required by the telecom operator. For example, for traffic prediction and forecasting, or to compute optimal policies for the RAN. As an example, we show the behavior of an X app that controls the scheduling policies of one of the DU of the RAN. The X app uses the metrics sent by the DU to select the optimal scheduling policy for each slice of the DU. We also show the reception of such control policies at the DU through the ORAN E2 interface. The figure shows the throughput for four of the DUs instantiated on Coliseum. At the beginning of the experiment, the RIC hosts X apps for data-driven control of the scheduling and slicing policies for DUs 1 and 2, while DUs 3 and 4 use static policies. At around second 450, we activate X apps at the RIC to control DUs 3 and 4 and their scheduling decisions. This causes a steep improvement in the performance of these DUs. This demo shows the potential of ORAN-based closed-loop control for wireless networks as well as how Coliseum, the world's largest wireless network emulator with hardware in the loop, can be used to generate countless wireless scenarios to train and test machine learning algorithms.